officer is trying to engage him in uh, communication, trying to get him to come off of the porch, making every effort to, to try to resolve this situation peacefully. Baltimore County Police say they had no choice but to shoot 59 year old Carrie Lee Comer on the front porch of his home in the unit block of Greenwood Avenue in Overly. It all unfolded at around 1045 Thursday night. Police got a call to the residence after his estranged wife reported he'd been acting suicidal all day. When officers arrived, one hid providing cover. The second tried to engage Comer in conversation. This officer issues clear verbal commands telling him to put his hands up, to come off the porch. He refuses. Police say Comer did not comply, then reached for his 30-30 scoped high-powered rifle and brought it up. And it's at that point that the first officer turns and runs for his life. The second officer fires two shots. Both shots strike the suspect in the upper body. Medics pronounced Comer dead at the scene. Neighbor Bob Inslee told 11 News he's surprised by what happened. Pretty much stayed to himself. He didn't, you didn't see much of him. He, uh, he did what he had to do over there and you, you didn't see much of him. Police say the officer who spoke with Comer and ran was wearing a body camera. The shooting officer was not. Now, because the case is still under investigation, police say that that body camera footage will need to first be reviewed by the state's attorney's office here in Baltimore County. Once it's sent back to police, we understand it should be released to the media sometime next week. We're live at Baltimore County Police Headquarters tonight in Towson. I'm Lowell Melser, WBAL, TV 11 News.